So just getting ready for my morning run, had some water, banana. Today on the program is a 70 minute uh, mild run, easy run they call it. I'll be running in the Sokini Canvera 10s. I got probably literally, not even a joke, somewhere around 700, maybe closer to a thousand miles on these. I've had them for three years, training for marathons and uh, ultras on the road. And they're still holding up. I don't use them for long runs anymore, but for these like mid runs, I throw them on, especially if I'm going in the trails because I don't care if I get them ruined. What I'm gonna try to do is there's some trails about a mile up the road, mile and a half up the road from my house. I'll jump in there just to get my feet on some trails. I didn't want to run on the treadmill. I wanted to do something a little different this morning. Running on the treadmill gets kind of boring. So I'm just gonna quickly roll out and um, put my shoes on, do a quick uh, go wad session. And then I'll go for a run, quick stretch on the way back, have breakfast. And then I have to go actually help the guys with an insult today. So maybe I'll take some videos and show you guys just kind of what I do for work again. And uh, yeah, good day. So rolling out my feet with the ball right now. If you guys don't do this, it feels so good. I learned it from Nick Bear. I was watching him do it. I had a lacrosse ball that I used on my calves, which is another one I can show you guys later. But Oh man, just rolling out your feet, especially if you're running a lot, opening them up, feels great. So we're gonna do a quick uh, quick little roll out warm up stretch, and then uh, we'll hit the trail. Probably see you guys when I get back. So, thanks for tuning in. Uh, I appreciate all the support. Like and subscribe, nothing fancy. I'm just showing you what day in, day out of a guy training is, and a little bit of my life, and uh, we see these great big workouts and they're not always like that. It's usually like a 70 minute mild run, you know, and then tomorrow there's a couple sprints and a fun little chipper workout. And then we got boxing tonight and we have kickboxing tomorrow. So that's pretty, uh, pretty tame. My weeks don't really vary all that much. Nothing gets too crazy. Hoping to go run a mountain today. I just wanted to show you guys this. So. The boys write my workout every evening when we have a workout at home, and then I make them write a workout for themselves. And uh, Alan did all this yesterday. Alvin fell off the track a little bit. He did a bunch of pull-ups. That's what he wanted to do. Just something to get down here and get moving because uh, they were kind of stuck in the house not doing a lot of activity yesterday. So they did a lot. I'm proud of them, and uh, they're coming along. It's fun having uh, two young men living at the house who want to do this kind of stuff. So. I'm enjoying it while it lasts. So, about 22 minutes in, just got out of the woods. Finally started to get a little clearer. Two miles on the road. Like I said, just taking it easy today. And uh, really loving the terrain and the weather. This terrain's very rocky. And make sure I don't roll any of my, uh, roll my ankle. But yeah, a little bit of hills. Nothing crazy here today. I wish it was a little more elevation, but this is what we got to deal with close to home when we want to run outside. So this is what we deal with. And uh, yeah, hopefully get to a mountain this weekend, get some outdoor running, and biggest part is get some downhill training so we don't blow up the hammies or anything like that on the downs. So yeah, beautiful morning. Hope you guys got out for a run. Sorry it's so shaky. See you guys later. My buddy the skunk just ran into the woods. Get out of here. I don't want to get sprayed. I don't know if you guys can see that white tail blown off in the woods. Whew. Almost got sprayed. My buddy the skunk is back. Get! 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 Get up there. I don't want to get sprayed. Get up in there. Get in the woods. You guys see him? Get in the woods. There you go. Come on. Get up there. Far enough away. There you go, buddy. There you go, buddy. 
Can you see him walking in the woods? Ah, oh, jeez. All right. So we just got back from my run, I'm getting ready to make breakfast. Had that run in with the skunk, and uh, it was pretty good. So I'm gonna have my standard breakfast with some fruit, yogurt, uh, Canadian bacon and egg, and a uh, bagel thin. And uh, yeah, got an install, like I said today. Feeling good, stretched after my run, finally. I'm trying to stay on top of that, because I'm very tight, so one, uh, tidbit I can give you is don't stop stretching because when you get old, you lose all your flexibility and get inside. So, I had a good day. Just leave a market basket. Had to pick up some dairy free sour cream, some cheese for taco night tonight. So, that's uh, going to be a lot of fun. Had a good install. I'll post some pictures up here. Pretty funky place. And uh, it was a good day. Lots of steps. I didn't wear my watch. And uh, so I have no idea how many extra steps, but that was definitely another 10,000. And uh, yeah, it was good. Now I'm just on my way home so I can get changed and go to boxing with our daughter tonight. And uh, another great day. We didn't get any biking in because of work, but I mean, I did enough labor carrying equipment and uh, walking that. I'm sure I did the same amount of calories, probably pretty close. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Probably check in with you guys before I go to bed and uh, just uh, give you a recap of the entire day. But so far, pretty good, beautiful, sunny day. Uh, parking wasn't an issue in Salem, Mass, so that's always nice. And uh, yeah, all right, check in later. See you. So just finished up the night. I had a great boxing class. I'll post my boxing score right here. <coughs> pretty good. <coughs> Got a pretty decent score. I was feeling pretty good tonight, except for this cough is still kicking around. Um, but one thing I did want to address is uh, Ryan Atkins, who's, you know, a legend in OCR. He posted a workout that I do frequently, and I've always wondered what top guys get in this workout. And it's a 15 by 15. So 15 minutes at a 15% incline, and you got to try to go as far as you can. And uh, he posted what he usually shoots for is 1.66. So if one mile is 15 minutes, then, you know, you're looking right around a 12-ish minute mile probably. So it gives you something like a standard what those guys do. And the other thing he did, he posted, I'll put the video right here, is a one ground to overhead with a dumbbell and then one one-handed chin-up, which I never thought of a test. So I really appreciate him uh, putting that up. But like I said, had a great day. Uh, good day of training, feeling good, ate tacos with the boys and the family, and uh, that was great. I had a nice big bowl of fruit for dessert, um, so I'm excited to see what I'm at. I think my weight is uh, 198 this morning, so I'm down two pounds, which is about what I shoot for a week, is two pounds a week. Uh, sometimes I lose a little more depending on how heavy the training is, but that's right kind of where I want to be. And then I'm still eating around 3,000 calories a day. Uh, give or take 100 here and there. So that's my update for today. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Like and subscribe to the video. And I'll catch you on the next one. Peace, guys.